What's good, YouTube? Nandy from 94 here to bring you a special episode of SCP Containment Breach. Now, I know I've cut it off a little bit, but I'm still trying to figure out exactly the size I need my recording setup to actually record the game. But this is about as good as I can get it. Anyway, uh, from what I know of SCPs, uh, <clears throat> SCPs are some weird creepypasta-esque thing going on. Um, that's pretty much about it that I know. But supposedly it's like a secret government er, thing that was established. Fuck, I have no idea. Anyway, let's just get started. All I know is that uh, we play as a D-class person. D-class is usually a... Um, D-Class is usually a uh, death row inmate, so I'm going to create the guy's name as Daniel. And yes, as I am probably going to wind up abandoning this at some point because this is something that's been happening on the channel recently, I've been hunting for jobs and stuff, so eventually I may not have the energy to actually record much. But I do plan on it, as well as plan on recording a D&D &D campaign that I plan on writing in bulk. Well, weekly, and then editing it during the week, and then posting it on the same day that we usually record it. <clears throat> anyway, let's get started. I named the character Daniel. I know the font's a little hard to read, but I fucked up when uh, setting up the game's resolution. So you're going to have to kind of deal with that. I have glasses, so I'm kind of like squinting at it. Anyway, without further ado, let's go and get into this. All right, SCP-096 is normally docile with pressure sensors. It sells, it spends most of the day pacing by a wall. Uh, the game takes a little bit to load, so I'm just gonna... Oh, and sometimes the game does have issues where it crashes, but they did just recently update this, so it probably is only like a minor bug thing right now. for the program to respond. I'll probably just cut this shit out. Yeah, me from the future, cut that out. That's just you and me in the loading screen. And this cup of coffee. Coffee is amazing. Okay, that's creepy. That's even more creepy, to be honest. 
I did change because I have problems with uh, the F buttons on my laptop. I have decided to um, make five my hotkey for um, quick saving. Ah, yay! It's lights. Press the tab to open up the inventory. Double click the document to view it. Okay. I double clicked it. Okay. Orientation leaf leaflet for the D class personnel. On behalf of the SCP Foundation and our staff, we welcome you to an exciting one month working period at one of our top secret research facilities. Unfortunately, the exact details of your upcoming work assignments are highly classified, but please read this document very carefully to make sure you stay as safe and pleasant as possible. Each of the D-Class personnel has been given a designation. Your personal designation is D-9341. Please memorize it as the staff will use it to refer to you from now on. During your stay, you will be taking part in various testing procedures, and some of them can be extremely Dangerous. Hey, asshole, I'm reading. Give me a moment. Whatever, you guys can pause the video and read the rest of that, if you can see it. All right, blow me, asshole. The game's a bit laggy, but I've heard that may actually be something to do within the game itself, so who knows? That's hilarious. Uh, the conversation that you may or may not have heard was um, apparently one of the guards uh, started talking to another guard and and they talked about how it'd be their first day or whatever and well we've been working together for five months. Okay, well, that explains the lag, where I'm only running on, like, three frames. Yeah, I know, I'm a death row inmate. By the way, what? I'm gonna say, quit playing with yourself and give me the damn paper. I played this a little bit just to, like, know what I'm doing. SCP-173, object class Euclid, clearance level 2... Item SCP-173 is to be kept in a locked container at all times. When personnel must enter SCP-173's containment container, no fewer than three may enter at any time, and the door is to be relocked behind them. At all times, two personnel must maintain direct eye contact with SCP-173 until all personnel have vacated and relocked the container. Origin is of yet unknown. It is reconstructed. It is constructed from concrete and rebar with traces of Krylon brand spray paint. SCP-173 is inanimate and extremely hostile. The object cannot move while in the direct line of sight. Line of sight must not be broken at any time with SCP-173. The object object is reported to attack by snapping the neck at the base of the skull or by strangulation. In the event of an attack, personnel are to observe Class 4 hazardous containment procedures. 
Reddish brown substance on the floor is a combination of feces and blood. Origin of these materials are unknown. The enclosure must be cleaned by on a bi-weekly basis. Okay, cool. Can I reread my orientation leaf right now? Now that this asshole is not rushing me. Please memorize your designation. During your stay, you will be taking part in various testing procedures. Some of them can be extremely dangerous if appropriate actions are not taken. This is why we need your full cooperation at all times in all circumstances. Our highly trained researchers and scientists know how to minimize the risk and ensure the safety of personnel involved in testing. If you fail to comply with the instructions you are given, you will be sent back to your term in death row. If everything goes as planned, meaning that we have your full cooperation, you will be released at the end of the month and you will be granted an absolute pardon for all your previous offenses. I wonder what the hell this guy did to actually get on death row, because death row is like a very serious thing. At least here in America, I guess. Because there's still people debating on whether it's actually, whether it should actually be a thing or not. I also don't like this thing. Because this thing reminds me of the Weeping Angels from Doctor Who. I'm gonna blink it. Let's just make sure I have the full uh, capacity to blink it. I wonder what this test was supposed to be. Was it just supposed to be like a cleaning? Stay away from me. Motherfucker! I didn't even say. Okay, I'm naming you David now. Because why not? David's a fun name. Chaos and group of foundation created by a cell that went AWOL with several highly useful SCPs in 1924. Uh, okay, so they're probably the SCPs the foundation hasn't found yet. Cool. They also kind of remind me of the Predator of Steel from that uniform there. I'm not sure if you guys can see it or not. Because I know the loading screens take a while, I'll probably edit these out, but I am, like, checking on my phone and shit, so... If you wind up, like, hearing me talk about something that I found, like, I've got, um... I've got, like, random new shit sometimes that pops up on my phone. I'm gonna check some of my uh, dailies for some games that I play. Well, I wait patiently for this uh, loading screen, which I'll probably just edit out and shorten the video, or at least try to. I remember uh, trying to edit out some bits of the Oni video, and it wound up being longer than it should have. And it really shouldn't have been. 
And also, the reason I'm going to be shirtless in some of these videos is because recently it's been getting like very hot in my recording area. That's also why you probably can hear a uh, fan in the background. Their footstep, which means it's been closer to being able to actually use. Getting up again. Take that paper, just because this is the tutorial stuff. I'm double clicking it. Okay, D9341. I like that. Oh, if you survive a month in here, you'll wind up being released. With full pardon. Alright. Let the asshole come out. Come on. So, three, one, one. Okay. I'm out of my cell. And I'd recommend you shutting the fuck up before I shove my cock down your throat. Wait, what? Okay, I think I know what he's in jail- what we're in jail for. <clears throat> I did not mean to actually say that out loud. No. Okay, that's kind of cool. Each time you change the map seed, each time you change the map seed, the conversation the guards were having is different. That's kind of innovative, to be honest. I don't know why we have a blink timer, I really think it's stupid, but I know it's because of 173, specific. I am, like, right on this guy. I mean, I know we're supposed to be faster than him, and apparently, from what I've heard about, like, the character we play as, may very well be an SCP. Man, I'm sorry I haven't sh shanked you with a ship yet. Ah, uh, give me... What the fuck was that? That was like really loud and in my ear. I was gonna say, I kinda need that to get out of my line of sight so I can keep that thing in my line of sight. One of us was supposed to clean the blood speech, the blood shit.
five to say. There we go. Shit, 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 shit. Oh my god, I clipped into the wall! Well, this is bloody horrifying. 079, stop fucking with me. And I believe that's supposed to be 682, but I think I'm safe from 173 while I'm clipped into the wall. So I think both things, good things, came out of the glitchy fucking bit of me, uh, saving. But I do need to- I do need to reload. 914 is a large clockwork device weighing seven. what the fuck? Yep. Still inside the wall. Okay, looks like I need to start a new game. Well, anyway. Okay, this has been SCP Containment Breach. Um, this is a very, very interesting term of events. Well, a very interesting, um, turn of events. But, yeah, this is interesting to say the least. And I'm going to quit. Safe and just why not? I'm gonna see if this works. I'm going to see if this works. If so, we're gonna make this an hour long video, or at least the recording is an hour long. It'll probably be condensed to me hunting shit down. And it'll be perfectly in time for DBZA Part 3 of six Part Episode 60. Yeah, I thought it was going to crash. Or not. In the coming week here, I'm going to actually start streaming um, Assassin's Creed as a celebra celebration for um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, which I will probably get September 29th. It's been a while since I've checked my PS4, but uh, I'll be streaming mostly Assassin's Creed games, and I will be trying to 100% them, so these would be like 6-7 hour strings. Oh yay, I'm still 
in the fucking ground. Which means, yep. Console commands, right? No? What's console commands? Okay, yeah. This has been SCP Containment Breach. Thanks for watching.